Hey everybody, it's Mike. I uh, messed up on my video earlier, um, so I'm kind of going back and re-recording what I'm doing. Uh, right now, I'm telling everybody about uh, what I use. Um, I use the shock floors, as you can see, and then I place the roof, making it as square as possible. And then, uh, just popping off some jokes, probably. <laughs> anyway, um, so I go through this showing on that about that, and I start grabbing. I think I grab the wall, start grabbing the walls. No, I said grab the walls. Yeah, there you go. Okay. <laughs> I start placing the walls down and making sure they're close as possible. Uh, yeah, you saw that little mistake that I was trying to do. And then I place the upside down triangles. Now, they don't place very easily, so you have to put them basically on the up opposite side. And the same for that one goes on the opposite side. And then I should be placing all the walls down here shortly. Being an idiot like usual. No. <laughs> anyway. Get the walls put down. Just like so. And there you go. Now, I didn't make a motor this time. I figure if you guys wanted to know about that, I'll try to hook you up with the laziest dork, and he can probably tutorial it on how to build that motor. I looked at his picture and kind of figured it out that way so and now right now I am grabbing the ladder if I quit trying to grab something else and moving very slow because I am overweight like usual <laughs> and I place that down and then of course I start grabbing the floors and start placing them But, uh, yeah, I, uh, started, for some reason, I, I don't really like PlayStation's recording system. It kind of sucks. Only allows up to 15 minutes. And, I, of course, I went over the 15 minute mark. And I completely forgot about it, so now I'm doing the voiceover. So, be, be patient with me. Please be patient. Of course, you know, I like jumping over big gaps. It sounds like fun. Then I spent, like, a few minutes trying to look for a concrete pillar that I don't see. And I start rambling on them. Where is the plant? Blah, 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 blah. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, I finally figure out, well, I don't have the concrete pillar, which I'm looking around, thinking I have it. I'm trying to do everything in the dark, of course. So, eventually I stop. Place it down. There you go. Okay, now grab the pillar. Sorry, everybody. This guy is just so slow. I don't know what his deal is. <laughs> ah, of course, I grab the pillar. Grab. No, you gotta move it closer. There you go. Now you can pick it up. There. Now you notice I didn't pick it up 
and place it in put you know I'd rather do it on top try to get as close as I can and there we go we start placing it down moving it in you know it's kind of scared about falling off here so you'll see me drop it and realize it is too far apart but I left it anyway because being allotted the time so as you notice I did it it doesn't look that bad because the wall will basically fill in that gap so I can put in the wall right about here soon after you know I take away my pillar or move my pillar any day now there we go <laughs> Now I go climbing back up the ladder, making my leap of faith. <laughs> you like that little pond there? <laughs> anyway, get back to commentary here. And then I'm all talking. I prefer you can put the glass with the small wall on. But I prefer all glass if I ever find it other way yeah other way there you go keep going keep going you eventually find that one you can put that one in or you can just put the all glass in I tend to like the all glass because I can see a whole lot better right now I'm just building the frame around it And then of course I put the floor in I mentioned about uh, the deck here you can uh, put anything around the deck bars the what do you call it I can't think of the stupid name now I'll show it and I actually build it here pretty soon I put the ladder in of course and I start yabbering about the antenna which I use a small wall up here keep going no keep going there you go all right we got that now we can place the radio beacon basically no wrong way there you go okay now you can place the recruitment beacon I like to have it that way and that is good and I'll start yabbering about what you can do to fix your deck now, of course, I mentioned about the controls here pretty soon. I think I actually decided to put the controls in just in case I make it into a motorized boat. Now, I use the conduit. Conduit. Uh, where you cut? Switch. There we go took me a few minutes to remember it and of course I cheated place it down there you go place the other oh, wait a minute it's crooked fix it you gotta pull back there you go fix it Now I grab the other one and just place it in. Now you can use the I like using the sh one you know, I'll sh just hold off for a minute and I'll be able to tell you. I'm yapping about something. I don't remember what I'm yapping about. 
Give me a few minutes. I think I eventually get it. Get what I was yammer about, then I move on. The, the yeah, the cabinets, large cabinet on the floor. And then we use the carpet, not the one with rubber, the one with cloth. There we go. There for the longest time I was using both until we got the other stuff for vaults and stuff. And I realize here shortly after trying a couple times that the rug is not far enough out. So I'm, of course, move the cabinet up, move the rug in. There you go, good boy. Okay, well, still not good enough. Do a little bit more. There we go. Okay, am I happy? I should be happy on this one. I should just drop it. There we go. I dropped it. I left it alone. Okay. Now I'm explaining. I did the same. Well, kind of like what I did for the houseboat. I put the controls on the side of the cabinet to make it more, I guess, more realistic or whatever for controls. Then I... If I go the right way, I am putting the, yeah, you got to go the right way first. The, yeah, where those are. <laughs> Shack balcony railings. You can put those on or you can put any anything you want to make it look like the, your deck uh, yeah I'm not too picky on this one I just built it quick but I'm pretty sure you guys can slow it down if you need to go back and take a look at it. You just got to make sure your roof is straight and in line with everything. Because if that's out of, out of whack, it will mess you up. Then you basically have to tear the boat back apart and redo it. And finishing up on this side, trying to. Still trying to put it in there. There we go. Now I left that back open just so that way I can put the motor on if I decide to. Um, you can put a conduit on the front to make it look like your anchor point, which isn't bad. And then I think that pretty much wraps it up. Alright, guys, I appreciate you checking out this video. Um, Hit the like, subscribe. You can follow me on Twitch. You can follow me on Twitter. I'll leave the areas up. And I will possibly catch you guys later. If you have any comments or complaints or anything, please leave them down below. And 
I will catch you guys later.